hello everyone welcome and welcome back to my channel today again i am back with another important email call on basic electrical engineering so study evening one of my subscribers has messaged me and he told me to solve this numericals so today in this video i'll be solving this numericals so here this numerical was also asked in get 2023 and here you can see for the circuit shown if i equals to sin 1000t the instantaneous value of Thevenin's equivalent voltage in volt across the terminal A to B at time t equal to 5 millisecond is. Here we need to calculate the Thevenin's voltage that is Vts here. And here, in order to solve this circuit, first you need the concept of source transformation. So here, normally or generally the source transformation is done in order to simplify the circuit. And here we have two conditions. First one is the conversion of voltage source into current source, and the second one is the conversion of current source into voltage source. Here you can see a resistor is connected in series with this voltage source. So here, if you need to calculate this voltage source into current source, then here a resistor will be placed in parallel with this current source. And now, in second condition, if you need to convert this current source into voltage source, then here you can see a current source and a resistor is connected in parallel. Now this voltage source and this resistor will be connected in parallel if you convert this current source into voltage source. So this is the concept of current transformation. Now so this is our circuit diagram. Now if you solve this here you can see if you here you can see 10 ohm and Z ohm. Here we can see a resistor and inductor is connected in series. And here we have current source, sinusoidal current source. Here we have. And if you convert this current source into voltage source, then we can write here this current source will be converted in voltage source. So right now we'll write since we know the amplitude of this sine wave is one, so it will be 10 plus Z10 volt. Here you can see the voltage source is 10 plus Z10 volt. And now this 10 ohm resistor and this Z10 ohm inductor will be in series with it. So 10 ohm and Z10 ohm this resistor, sorry this inductor is connected in series with this voltage source. Now we will apply KVL in this loop. So let's say the current is following in this direction. So if we apply KVL then here we can see this is our sinusoidal voltage source. So 10 plus Z10 volt, so here I have written 10 plus Z10 volt and minus 10 ohm plus Z10 ohm into Ix. So minus 10 plus Z10 into Ix and here you can see minus 2 plus 4 Ix. So it will be plus 4 Ix minus again 10 ohm and this there is our capacitor. So here a capacitance value is minus 10 ohm. So 10 minus Z10 ohm. So minus 10 minus Z10 ohm into Ix equal to 0. And now here you can see 10 plus Z10 and minus 10 Ix minus Z10 Ix plus 4 Ix minus 10 Ix plus Z10 Ix. Now this value and this value will be cancelled out. So here we will get 10 plus Z10 plus 4 Ix minus 20 Ix equal to 0. So if you solve this we will get here Ix will be 10 plus Z10 upon 16 and now here if you calculate this in the form of magnitude and angle then here you can write first be sure your calculator is in complex mode so here you can write 10 plus 10 this i upon this 16 so 16 press equals to now press shift and press 2 we need the answer in this r angle theta form so now press 3 here and then press equals to. So you can see 5 root 2 upon 8 and pi upon 4 is going to be 45 degree. So here if you please press this SD, then we will get here 0 0.8838. Since this is in radian mode, so if you press shift mode and here we have in degree mode. So if you press 3 here, then we will get in degree. It means our value is 0 0.883 and angle is 45 degree. So we will get here 0 0.884 angle 45 degree. Now here, now Vts will be 
here you can see the value of ix is 0 0.884 angle 45 degree this is an ampere now if you calculate vts then vts will be since we are calculating the value of vts here so vts will be v equals to i or ohm's law so v equal to ix so ix into this 10 minus z 10 ohm since these two are connected in series here this resistor and this capacitor are connected in series so 10 minus z 10 into this ix so we'll get here in place of ix here we have 0 0.884 angle 45 degree so 0 0.884 angle 45 degree into so 10 minus z 10 x so here we can see so 10 minus 10 i press equals to now shift Two. and if you need this in form of r angle theta then press 3 so you get here 10 root 2 angle 14.14 into sorry 14.14 angle minus 45 degree so we'll see here 14.142 angle is minus 45 degree now here we'll see the angle is positive here and here the angle is negative so these two angle will be cancelled out now so if you simply multiply these two values 0 0.884 into 14.142 will get the value as 12.5 and angle will be 0 degree here now we need the value at here you can see we need the value at t equal to 5 millisecond so if we calculate the value of vts so vts will be 12.5 sin 1000 t and now here in place of t here we have 5 millisecond now we put the value of t as 5 millisecond here we will get 12.5 into sin 1000 t so vts will be 12.5 into sine 1000 t so 12.5 into sine 1000 into 5 into 10 power minus 3 since the value of t is in millisecond and t equals 5 milliseconds so 5 into 10 power minus 3 so here if you calculate we will get the value of vts as 11.986 volt so this is our final answer hope you enjoy the lecture thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you